<laughs> Boys, they've not only gone and just done that again. It seems like with every Need for Speed Payback announcement, my hype just it goes up and up and up. And in this kind of announcement we had that literally just came out, they have released the world. So not only have they talked about the world and, you know, the separate parts of the world, but they also released a trailer. And in this trailer, that's honestly one of the best they've done so far, up there with the cop trailer, which they had at Gamescom, it actually showed quite a lot. And we're going to go through that in today's video. We're kind of going to go ahead and do a bit of an overview. But I am so excited for this game now is just a bit of ridiculous anyway with that being said let's go ahead and get straight into the trailer so in this trailer we have seen the most like out of all the trailers we have seen up to this point we've seen pretty much all the world we've seen the city areas in the desert areas in the canyon areas and i've got a few things kind of notice about you uh, about the actual trailer itself a few kind of like easter eggs that i put in there as well as you know just talking about the city because it looks absolutely gorgeous so i'm not going to bother go ahead and talk about um you know each car that's unveiled. I'm sure there's going to be plenty of videos about people talking about the new cars that have been unveiled in this trailer. What I'm going to go ahead and do is talk about something which is a bit more important to me. That's the actual world since the trailer is about the actual world. Like I said, insane. We finally got our first look at Fortune Valley City area and it really does look as good as I anticipated. When you're making Las Vegas, it's kind of hard because a lot of it is desert, a lot of it is kind of just like, it's a bit barren, it's a bit, you know, bland. But when you go into the city area, it completely changes. The vibe and the level it's on is completely different. As we can see from this clip specifically, right at the start, the city at night is just absolutely beautiful. You know, the light with the frostbite engine and really transforms how this game looks. Absolutely just insane. But then they took it one step further, and to be honest, this is the one area I really want to try. And I'm pretty sure for most people that know me, I'm talking about the canyons. Now, we actually spotted in this little screenshot. It's very hard to see because it's all happening so fast, but there's no barriers at one point. Now, this could either mean two of two things. So it could mean that A, there's going to be invisible walls, or B, we can actually fall off canyons. It's just, what else can I say, really? No barriers on the canyons. That is just insane. We haven't had something like that since Carbon, and even then, Carbon did have destructible barriers. So just to be able to fall off a canyon, insane. Honestly, like, really little thing, but one of the things I'm most excited for. The canyon drifting and the canyon battles is just going to be absolutely insane. It looks like there's so much variety in the map. If you're a drifter, you go to the canyons. If you, you know, you if you're a police guy, you can go to the inner city areas or the kind of outskirts. If you're a racing guy, it just looks like there's so much variety in all of it just again leaves me with nothing but good things to say about this game now this perfectly leads me on to drag racing so as we know we finally saw our first piece of drag racing gameplay in this trailer and it's quite interesting so we're going to go ahead and get straight into that now so as we can see on the screen there is kind of a bar kind of similar to how underground was and other drag racing and games have been um you've got a bar and you're basically going to get a perfect shift you get if you get a per perfect shift you get a bit of a boost than you would if you did a normal shift and basically you want to keep on getting perfect shifts to win we can also see that there's a side bet on this screen and the side bet says to do a total wheelie um, for less than a second which again wheelies are actually a thing you know when you saw that a few months ago in the trailer that wasn't just you know tr fancy trailer stuff that's actually going to be in game wheelies are going to be a thing in Need for Speed. Um, I might be wrong in saying this. Pro Street was the last, maybe. Maybe it would might have been one of the shift games. This is huge. The fact drag racing has got its own dedicated mode in itself is a huge thing. So, again, just nothing but great things to say about that. Drift, drag, circuit, and cops. Four modes that are just going to just last so long for me. We also got a look at some of the actual drag cars, and you'll see that in, you know, as the trailer's playing by itself, um, and they're called the Riot Club. So there's actually a little kind of clan I guess of drag racers they call themselves the riot club and they seem to have some part of the story and I guess we're gonna hear more about that in the future as well as that we also heard about league 73 and they seem to kind of be the offload off-road clan in the game again which is pretty cool again just showing us more story elements in the game again one of the most story driven Need for Speeds in a very very long time just again more reason for me to get excited about Need for Speed Payback I honestly think I'm most excited to drive around in the city and just have a good time drifting and trying out the new modes and the cops there's so many things I'm excited for in this just trailer alone. It really, really gets... Every time I see these Need for Speed trailers, 
like, I, I, when I see Forza trailers, and when I see Gran Turismo trailers, and when I see all the other trailers, I don't really get as excited as I do when I see Need for Speed ones. When I see these in my inbox, and it's like, oh shit, like, this is a Need for Speed trailer, it just completely, like, it has me. Every, like, can you not see my eyes right now? <laughs> Uh -huh. Anyway, that's it for the trailer breakdown. Um, again, the full trailer will be down in the description, so if you want to go ahead and watch it, link is down there below. Um, yeah, what do you guys think of the world in Need for Speed Payback? Yay? Nay? Honestly, from all I've seen, I can, I, I just need it now. I just need it in my life. So, Ghost, if you want to give me the game early, um... Yeah, you've, you've got my email. Anyway, with that being said, if you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, make sure you go ahead and hit the like, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. You guys have an awesome, stay safe, and peace.